Strictly Come Dancing judge Craig Revel Horwood has had his say on the show's gender pay gap row. Last year, it was revealed that newcomer Shirley Ballas had been paid £180,000 by the BBC for her first series as head judge £70,000 less than Len Goodman had been paid for the same job. However, in April, The Mirror reported that Shirley had scored a £70,000 pay rise to bring her wage up to the same as Len's. Advertisement, continue writing below Shirley's pay puts her on the same wage as longtime judge Bruno Tonioli, but is more than Craig's and that of Darcy Bussell, who joined the show in 2012. Speaking to The Sun, Craig insisted that Shirley should have started on a lower wage to Len, because she was less experienced. He argued, the point about this pay thing is, yes, I think women should be paid the same as men. That's for sure, but what would you say to a woman coming in after you've been in the job for 15 years when they've done absolutely nothing to earn it? I don't think that's right. If, for instance, Shirley Bell is in that way, you'd expect she would start on something lower because she's never been on TV before, the show's been going for 14 years, Len Goodman earned a major reputation and put the show on the map like we all did. We all created it from the beginning. And I don't think it's comparable. Sorry. It just isn't. Strictly Come Dancing is due to return on BBC One in September. Want up to the minute entertainment news and features? Just hit like on our Digital Spy Facebook page and follow on our at Digital Spy Instagram and Twitter account.